Welcome everybody to Disney's uh, Vero Beach Resort. You ready? I'm ready. I'm so ready. Let's check on in. It's going to be a nice, relaxing day. Oh my goodness. I think we actually have a beach view. This is going to be a beautiful stay. Here's the Port Cashier. It's a pretty small hotel. It's really nice and cozy. I've been here once. Comment down below if you guys were here about last year. We have to keep our eye out also for some lovely sea turtles because it's hatching season. What do you say? Let's go park and head on in. I can't imagine our room is going to be ready, but I don't know, who knows? Maybe they'll surprise us. But we're here with Sam. Sam's back in the vlogs. I'm back. Miss me? Yeah, you haven't been here in a while. No. Yeah. Not in a minute. Sam drove for the record. I didn't drive with my car. I did. I didn't, I didn't drive with my car, so <laughs> yeah, thanks for driving. Hey, you know, just making sure we get here safe. Yeah. And Safe not and sound. On fire. Yeah, right. Crazy. Now, if you don't know what Vero Beach is, this is a Disney hotel. Um, it's DVC points. I believe you can only book it with DVC points. It's um, just two hours southeast of Walt Disney World. It's elegant. It's a fashioned hideaway located on Florida's scenic Atlantic Treasure Coast near the charming, charming community of Vero Beach. That's what Disney has on their site. It's beautiful. I've been here before and I actually did see a cool little photo op on the other side of this Porta Cashier. Straight ahead. Sam's ready going in. She's like, I want to go in. Check this out though. TikTok, the crocodile is greeting us. You know, you think they would do like a sea turtle, but this is kind of cool. Twins. Twins? Yeah. Your yeah. name's Kyle. That's a crocodile. Ah, uh, hey, good one. Also, peep, peep her shirt. Can you talk about it? Yeah. How was the Disney Wish? It was amazing. It was the, the most beautiful, amazing ship ever on the planet. I loved it. Can't wait to go back. She was on the inaugural. The inaugural sailing. Mm -hmm. Cool. Cool merch there, though. Yeah, but, the yeah. merch is great. I have more things, but I didn't bring them with me. I love it. She, couldn't, she couldn't stop talking about it in the car ride. She's like, Kyle, wait to see my shirt. 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 It looks great. I have a mug that matches it too, so I can wear the mug. Like, I can drink my coffee from the mug that matches the shirt. And I got ears. Wow, and dude, totally cool, man. Gnarly. Okay, welcome to Vero Beach. Let's head on in. For those of you new around the channel, or um, if you guys have been here before, just go ahead and comment down below. And if those of you guys are returning, also comment down below. You guys were here when we came here last year. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Smells great. Got some turtles right off here to the right. It's a really small and elegant type lobby. Very tiny. Ah, oh, so good to be back though. I think last time we came here, there was a lot of um, restrictions with COVID. Actually, I don't even remember. It's been so long. It's been a while. I've never been here, so. Welcome. I do not know where you're going. You're um, standing on a sea turtle right now. No. It's kind of like a vibe. Sea turtles everywhere. Absolutely. Sweet. First visit. They ring the bell. I love that. Anything this visit? Um, no. first visit. Yeah, first there we visit. go. Yeah, yeah. That's okay. Great. We do have a small little update here in the lobby. Last time we were here, there wasn't like a little gap. Disney's kind of like transitioning this with all their hotels, so it's kind of cool. But the beautiful mural has always been here. But welcome to the amazing lobby. It's really big. We're actually going to be staying in this building. Um, this is the inn, but we do have an ocean view. Our room obviously isn't ready yet. Disney always promises around 4 o'clock, but check out this amazing lobby. It's, it's beautiful. It doesn't really smell beachy like I remember it last time. It's kind of like missing that Disney smell in a way, for me at least. So grab some shell and surf the EAC with me. We were listening to that song the whole car ride. Leave me alone, Sam. <laughs> Uh-oh. It's no CM season. No. These are like the worst bugs in the world. Uh, they do actually give us, we forgot to get bug spray, but they do give us some, so that's going to be nice. You literally can't see them, but they're deadly. They, they, we will probably be walking away with bug bites. Hopefully not, though. I literally hate those. <laughs> I'm leaving. No, you're not. Okay. The best way to describe Vero Beach is, I'm actually taking it from, I think, Crystal from down below. She said, you get the Disney magic without the Disney crowds. So it's beautiful. It's great. We're actually going to be signing up for a mixology class up here um, tonight. It's margaritas. So we're going to be doing that. We're going to be doing a lot. But today is all about just relaxing and chilling. And uh, yeah, welcome to Vero Beach.
chilling out, relaxing, relaxing all cool and all, shooting some b ball outside. <laughs> That's cool. Okay. I was like, okay. It took me a while. <laughs> So again, real quick, here is uh, the main lobby. We've got the check-in, relatively small, but like they, act they actually are at capacity too. So this is gonna be a good way to actually kind of like show you guys like how like crowded it doesn't get here because <laughs> it's really relatively small. I'll actually show you the map. Sam's holding all the information that they gave us. And there's also a nice little gift shop here called the Island Grove. We're gonna go there real quick and just see what kind of have because I might want to get something. Oh, this is nice. Did we say you've never been here before? Yeah. Okay. Just making sure. Lonnie. Lonnie, thanks for watching the vlogs. All the way up on the third floor up there. What was that? I said you're all the way up on the third floor. <laughs> I'll see you around. Sweet, man. See you, bud. That's cool. When you guys are here. Awesome. Um, let's go into the gift shop here real quick. Since we kind of have... Oh, we have a while. Store hours, 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. That's great. Sam, go pick out something. Go pick out something. <laughs> this. Oh, nice. What do we got here? It's the first thing I saw. That oh, perfect. It. Relax and enjoy. Exactly what Vero Beach is. Look at Squirt, dude. You totally rock. It's a relatively small gift shop. I mean, you know, they're not going to have a huge gift shop, but it's nice and cozy. Got a lot of DVC merch here. Um, it's cute. It's really cool themed as well, unlike some like Disney um, gift shops. You know what I mean? Oh, he is. Hey, you want some fresh oranges? <laughs> yes, please. Is it real? There's no way. Yeah, no, they're fake. <laughs> no, but how cute are they? No way. You can build a sand castle, but it's like, you know, the castle at um, Disney World. It's Cinderella's castle. I've never seen that before. We should buy this. <laughs> I don't want to buy this. Okay. We'll come back. It's $10. I've never seen that. I've never seen this mug before. This is why I like going to like other Disney properties because they have different like merch. I've never seen this before. You should get these for when we play Mermaids later. <laughs> We're not getting that. So you're not gonna play Mermaids later? No, I'm sorry. You're gonna have to find somebody else. This is cool too. I love my mugs. Look at this one. Wow. Okay. I like this one. This is gonna be a long video, guys, by the way. <laughs> Look what I found. They have complimentary water here, but in the shape of a Mickey. Oh, first into Mickey. I'm gonna try. Heck yeah. I'm gonna try this water. It's gotta be good, right? It's good water. <laughs> we found a big table here in the lobby. We just wanna show you guys our really cool little key cards and then just like a map of Vero Beach. We're gonna be going in the ocean. That's Atlantic Ocean, by the way. Here's kind of like a quick overview of how uh, relatively small and cozy this resort is. I would kind of put it in the size of, I don't know, it's definitely way smaller than a value. It's just really, really cozy. And there's a lot to do. There's a pool and whatnot. You'll see it all, but um, our room, again, isn't ready. We're gonna actually have to put our car underneath this uh, building here. I didn't know that there was a parking garage under here. Sam gets to do the honors of uh, showing you guys our room keys. For the record, he wouldn't let me open them until now. Nope. You have to, you have to look ready. Three, two, one, open. Oh, well, I have to open it up. Yeah, here we go, here we go. Cool, right? Right? Go with the flow. Dad and son, <laughs> dad and son right there. Squirt. Outside we go, we're kind of just gonna go on venture real quick. I think we're gonna go sign up for the mixology, which is right on over by the pool. I think they actually have weddings over here. Last time we were here, I think someone was getting married. So if you guys are interested in getting married, oh, you hear that ocean? <gasps> oh. it sounds just like the ocean. It sounds majestic. Yeah. I love this place. Here's a look at the main building. That's where I think we will be. Like one of these, we have like an ocean view. Hopefully we have like a pretty darn high because like the second story doesn't really look too high, but at least you guys can kind of see what Vero Beach is all about. There's also cottages. Uh, those are like villas, so they're three bedrooms. Um, those are right on the beach. This is, again, the main building that usually most people stay in. Also, guys, if you could do me a favor, please go ahead and uh, thumbs this video up. And if you guys are new, I invite you guys to subscribe and enjoy the channel. Join the channel. We're going to head down this way. Get on it. We got a hammock. Do your swinging, girl. We've got cornhole, which looks like there's uh, gonna be here every day. And that's actually like the quick service where I think we're gonna have some Mickey waffles in the morning tomorrow. We're gonna have two vlogs here because we technically have two days in a way. You know, we're staying the night, but 
Um, let's head on over to the pool. I think I'm personally most excited to go out on the beach, which is weird because I'm not really a beach person, but I'm kind of turning into be one, but there's sea turtles nesting. It's nesting season, so maybe we'll be lucky to see some turtles hatch or just the nest itself. But here's the pool. They got a beautiful slide and it looks kind of crowded. And you cannot just walk in here, guys. You need a room key. Sam's in charge of that. Hey, what's the password? <laughs> Scan your room key, miss. Hey, squirt or crush? Squirt, squirt, squirt. Sorry, crush. They go green. Yay! Holy camoli. It is hot, hot, hot out today. Hot, hot, hot. We're here uh, renting. Oh, sorry, we're not here renting. We're actually signing up for Mixology, but it looks like they have like a question every day. Who do you think is more powerful? I'm gonna say Scarlet Witch. Captain Marvel is pretty powerful, but I vote Scarlet Witch. EB and Flo's rental. This is where you come to sign up for everything. The mixology was actually pretty pricey. $45 per person, but I guess there's chips and guac. Well, if you think about it, three drinks. What's 45 divided by three? Okay, when you put it that way, but we're just like, whoa, it's more expensive than we thought. It's gonna be good though. It's gonna yeah, be good though. That's not bad. $45 hairs. Or your dollars. Sort of kind of strolling around before we head on over to the beach. Here's a look at the cottage. It's literally like your own house on the Atlantic Ocean. Have no idea how expensive these bad boys are, but I can probably say they're expensive. They're probably worth it. It's like your own house. Yeah, right? Quick look at the amazing and beautiful Atlantic Ocean. It looks like there's now like a hill. I don't recall there being like a hill here. So it looks like they've done some, I don't know, refurbishments in a way. And I can also see some nests down there for sea turtles. But I don't remember there being like two tiers of the beach. We'll have to check that out. It's like a hill. See, caution, steep drop. There she is, the beautiful ocean. Seeing the ocean is just gearing me up for Friday, everybody. Can't wait for Friday. Cruise, cruises are back on the channel starting Friday, which is gonna be amazing. And uh, just to let you guys know, we'll probably be going live on a Friday and then we'll have those cruise videos pumped out. But uh, gosh, I love the ocean, terrified of it, but it's beautiful. It's beautiful. I don't know if we're gonna go out kayaking. It looks kind of wavy, but we'll see. Check this out though. This is so beautiful on how you get to the ocean. We actually just kind of reserved an um, umbrella. I think it was like $20 for the whole day up until six. Look at that beautiful walk into the ocean. It's what you pay for, ladies and gentlemen. It's beautiful. Beach clothes, dusk to dawn. FYI as well, Wind and Waves bar, they have Dole Whip. I forgot about that. We're kind of sitting here enjoying rocking chairs right now. I feel like uh, we're like 50 years old, living our best lives. Let's go to the beach, beach, let's get away. We're going to our little uh, umbrella. It's kind of windy out today. I don't think we're gonna be going out there. We'll definitely go swimming, but I don't think we're taking a kayak. A little bit dangerous. The water's very pretty. Oh, we gotta get our number. We gotta go find out what one we are. So the beach has been a newfound love for me, but I can already tell you that I'm inexperienced. You don't wear shoes to the beach, Kyle. What are you doing? Yeah, I gotta take him off. <laughs> rookie Kyle makes a rookie mistake, it's okay. It's all good. You just take him off. <sighs> Looks like a big tip, get here early because uh, if you get here earlier, you get a front row. We're gonna have like a back row, which is all right. Here's what we're working with. This was about $26 for the day. That nice. Well, we just got to the beach, just put our sunscreen on, and our room is ready. We're on the fourth floor, we're gonna have a beautiful view. I can't come to the beach and not go into the ocean, so we're gonna go in the ocean real quick, and then we're gonna go check out the room. To the beach. To the beach we go. Let's take a little dip, and then go to the room, and I guess we'll uh, save the, the, uh, the sea turtle nest for when we come back. Oh, that feels great. Wow. Here it comes. It is. Oh, they're kayaking. Beach done. Time to go to the room. Okay, 
We're gonna come back though, because I really want to. The room just got ready and I want to see the room, as do you guys probably. Our room is gonna be one of these bad boys all the way up there. And I did actually have to shout out a couple of you guys because this wouldn't have been possible unless it was uh, up to one of you guys. A big shout out to Ellie. And Amelia. And the Pack family. <laughs> Thank you guys so much uh, for uh, giving us your stay here. They couldn't make it and they emailed me and they said, do you wanna show this? Do you wanna stay here to, and show everybody on YouTube? And I said, absolutely. Thank you so much for thinking of me. So thank you guys, thank you Pack family and um, sorry you guys couldn't make it. Really had no idea there was a parking garage underneath the whole building. This is where we were told to go to the park and parking's free by the way. They don't charge you extra. Super nice, super, super nice. Into the elevator we go. Fourth floor, please. Four. Fourth floor. Fourth floor. Gonna be a good look at the hallways. Looks like there's cedar, sea, <laughs> sea turtles on the carpet. Holy cow, I've never been this high before. Look at this, there's the lobby. All the way down. 2413. Should be this way. Do we have a cool room? Wow. This gonna be cool. This is like the best part, just like kind of finding out where your room is. Looks like we're not in like the main lobby area. We're just gonna be right off to the left, which is okay. On the fourth floor, gonna peep that ocean. One more look down. It's a beautiful resort. Sam's beating me to it. In we go. Let's check out this room. I'm more excited about the, the view. Oh my God, <laughs> yo. This room is amazing, but wait until you see this view. So what you guys are gonna see is a, a deluxe ocean view. Fourth floor, we're gonna start over here with uh, our little kitchenette. Huge refrigerator, absolutely huge. We get a microwave, which is clutch. We have a little sink, we have coffee, storage. Do we get any utensils? It looks like no utensils. Um, a room, we'll get there in a second. I'm actually gonna start with the bathroom. I never start with the bathroom, but got this nice little open concept with your other sink as well. We do actually have a lovely bathroom. It does have a curtain, so there's no sliding doors. The space, this room is all about space, in my opinion. We've got those normal conditioner, body wash, and shampoo. Um, to be a little picky, the room, uh, sorry, the bathroom is a little bit dated if we wanna compare it to other Disney resorts. We've got a closet here. Sam, could you um, open that closet for us? What's in there? I think there's a pack and play thing I saw. Yeah. I yeah. play uh, ironing board, extra pillow and blanket. And hangers. That thing. What's that for? A uh, drying rack, maybe? Or I don't know. Uh, room, service, room service, room service. Yeah, room service. Right. Now, and here's our um, bedroom. We have two beds. Two beds. We have an attachment door as well. I love this mirror, but there's a lot of space. A lot of space. Like, look over here. I think this is where like, the pack and play would go, or like your luggage. Sam's bed, my bed. I already called dibs by the ocean. So sorry. But it's beautiful, like I like the wood backdrop over there. That's really nice. The way to see the view. The, the, the view is what, what this room is all for. TV, I think this is a Samsung. Got your power cords right here, USB, no USB-C. Also on the dresser they have the same plugins as well. I just gotta show you guys this, like the view. It's absolutely insane, absolutely insane. The ceilings are really nice here too. Let's head outside and you guys can just listen. I've never been to Hawaii, but this kind of feels like Hawaii in Florida. Absolutely beautiful. 10 out of 10. I'm in love. In a couple days, we'll be surrounded by the ocean on our cruise. Can't wait. But today, it's a cruise on land. That's our mixology. We gotta go get something to eat real quick um, because we have a mixology class right on over there at four o'clock. So we don't really want to be too inebriated, so that's why we're gonna get something to eat and then go to the beach and then the pool and whatnot and then dinner. It's gonna be a, a great night. I feel like the one thing that Vero Beach lacks, if anything, they just don't have many food options, but there's plenty of surrounding places to get, but we're gonna test that out tonight, so maybe our opinion might change. Well, my opinion. I don't have one. Yeah, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> go with the flow. They've got a bar here that's got obviously alcohol and bar bites and then they also have like a sit down quick service over there that we'll be experiencing tonight but they also have like another place 
right over here this is what we're gonna be doing the wind and waves market and here's the hours looks like they'll close at like 9 30. here's a quick look at the menu if you guys want to pause and uh, check out what they have i don't know what i'm getting yet wait a second what is a whoopie pie i want to try this this looks good this is also where you get the dole whip um i think i'm just gonna bring out I've got a lovely banana cabana and also shout out to uh, Tim the bartender. He actually remembers me from last time. He watches the video, so thanks so much, Tim. Thanks for the banana cabana. It's a dangerous drink. I could have like five of these in like five seconds. We're not going to do that though because we have mixology in like 20 minutes. Then we got some uh, nummy nachos as well. Look at this one that I'm grabbing. Holy cow, we got a cheese heart attack here. Mm. Just nachos, nothing really special. It's just gonna hit the spot for me though. And then I also got this whippy pie. No idea what a whippy pie is, but have a look at her. It's kind of like a hidden Mickey. Let's give it a bite. Ooh. This is good. I don't know how to describe it. It's just nummy. It's soft. I thought it was gonna be crunchy. Real quick, I have to show you guys how they mark these turtle nests. I've got no idea how they know a turtle's nest is here, but some fun facts, average number of eggs, 115. It takes 55 days to hatch. Uh, I guess the size of the mother can be anywhere from 155 to 375 pounds. Insane, right? And the mother does not return at all to take care of her eggs, but may nest again in two weeks with a total of five nests per season, which is pretty darn cool. And these are all over the beach. How awesome would it be if they just start coming up right now? I think we're gonna be the only ones at this mixer. Does that mean we get more? Mixer! Who knows? Oh, oh. The door's in oh. oh, we're rope dropping. Oh yeah, that We are official. embarrassing for you. <laughs> no, you're fine, just a few more minutes though. Rope dropping alcohol, yay. Welcome to tequila tasting. We've got some chips and salsa. Looks like we're starting off with a shot. I don't like shots. Do I? Salute after Salt one drink. Very good. <laughs> 1940s, 1930s. Drink number two is a shot. So, a lot of Cheers. Questions. What comes first? A lot of the salt. Salt. Oh, look at that. We got a lot of pros here. I'm the worst. Right, I didn't yeah. take salt. the whole thing. I took a sip. Really? Come on. I swallowed it wrong. It's burning my throat right now. <laughs> They gave us another shot. Holy cow, I'm going to die. <laughs> Bro, we gave you the biggest shot ever. My, oh my why god. Is it this big? Holy cow. It Kyle, after big. three shots. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, this is my second shot. <laughs> Cheers. Wish me luck. Salute. Oh, that was so much better. On this one, guys, better. Gonna, I'm just sipping these shots. So I'm not even actually taking them. Baby. Kyle, after whatever number this is. <laughs> We got a smoky one. Oh, Kyle, after four level? drinks. Oh, on, uh, oh it smells so good. We're gonna be separate. We're gonna be, we're gonna be separate. Oof. I love tequila. Tequila is one with me. You gotta smell it first. <laughs> that is a chugger, everybody. And they said this is the strongest one. $45, well spent. I'd say worth it. Completely. So worth it. Let's go to the pool. Oh, we're clapping. <laughs> Before we head down to the pool, we gotta go catch the monitor room. Next stop, Magic Kingdom. Please stand clear of the doors. Por favor, blah, 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 blah. Oh, that was good. The ocean, just kidding. <laughs> Let's go swimming. Let's go swimming. It's pool time. Time to go down the slide. Yay. <laughs> down the slide. We go. Uh, check this out. They've got hidden Mickeys as we're going on up. I love this place. Holy camoli. I honestly think one, two, or three night stays are perfect here, and then you guys can go back to Disney World. That's what that's like my honest opinion. I mean you guys always get my honest opinion. Look at this, there's like nobody here. Check out this view though. Heck yeah, baby. Wow. <laughs> no line. 
Just views for days. Views for days. Cowabunga. Let's get it, baby. Pick up the speed. Pick up the speed. Come on. Come on. Oh. Woo. All right. Sam got a cool POV of me coming down the slide. Here's a cool little little shot. Can you the see water's it? really warm, yeah. You're gonna airdrop that to me, little do you know. Yeah. It's hot. I think the ocean would be a little bit better. I got BTS, behind the scenes. Behind the scenes, baby. Eee. That sun looks really cool. I don't know whose these are. I almost said that kid. Ooh. No way, we're about to go mini golfing, but they have pin trading here on the like the life. Oh my God, Bell. I love Bell, I don't have any pins, but I just wanted to show you guys. That's cool. cool is that? Sam is up first. She picked the pink ball. Will she get a hole in one? It looks like a fairly easy course. She's deciding to measure where the green is going. It looks like there's a dip. Just hit the ball. This ain't that serious. Three, two, one, and action. Quiet on the green here. And the ball goes. Looks like it is well short of the hole, which leads Kyle Palo to go. We are here live at mini golf, and now it is Kyle Palo's turn. He's lining up the ball. He has a blue ball. And he doesn't gonna, think much. He just goes. He's going to he's gonna hit it. Is he going to beat Sam? Probably not. Just because I don't think he will. And he didn't. That was, <laughs> that was pretty bad. That was pretty bad. <laughs> On the reel, I thought Sam was going to be good. That was five. I got three. Can y'all guess the score? Who do you think is in the lead? Wow. Ooh. After that, who do you guys think is in the... <laughs> Wow. Strike one. <laughs> Strike one. Obviously me. <laughs> and go. Ooh, okay. Oh, it's gonna roll down the hill? No. Lucky, lucky. Yeah. All right, Kyle's going. He thinks he's better than me, but he's gonna go. Yeah. He's the whole one. Yeah, right. Bounce. No, stop. <laughs> Anyways, let me just save you guys from the pain. I won by a lot. We learned that Sam isn't a good mini golfer. I'm a champ. Champion. You're still trying to get it? <laughs> Tell us the score. I um, tallied everything up. Uh huh. Uh, and Kyle, you got. You won. Um, you got 25. What'd you get? 52. <laughs> Any hole in one? No. It's wind and waves time. It's kind of like quick service. We'll see how good the quality is. We're kind of late to our reservation, honestly. Oh my God, <gasps> hey! Hi! How's it going? Good, good. Oh, you got some crayons coming so on in to dinner here? Thank Let's you. go. Wind and waves. Tom is hooking it up for us. What? I've, I've got you in the corner. Oh wait, they've got they've got Disney movies, Ratatouille. Can you guys see that? You guys can't see it. There, there's Ratatouille out in the grass over there. Uh, let's go. Let's go. Look at this. It's like quick service, but it's like sit down in a way. If y'all want to have fun at dinner, get the crayons. <laughs> you can do fun stuff. My cupcake is gonna look legit. Is it a cupcake? Yeah, it's gonna look really good. We've got French onion soup. And if you want to come over to my French onion, you can. You're invited. It's a, it's a party. La, 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 la. Thanks for inviting me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sam's really going to make me eat all this, but I'm not complaining because it's good. This burger looks amazing. Here we go. Going to put the bun with egg on top, smush it down, and that's what it's all about. This is a thick burger. Rest in peace to Kyle's weight. Holy cow! This thing is huge. You see this? It's like the biggest burger I've ever had in my life. That is great. Disney World needs this kind of burger. All right, everybody, that is gonna be it. 
for your daily dose. We'll see you guys tomorrow. We're going to kick it off here, and then who knows where, where we're going to go tomorrow, but it's been a good day. I think it, we had a great day. It's, it's been a great day. I would do this day again. Same. That's how good it was. Vero Beach. Mm-hmm. Heaven on Earth. Heaven on Earth. I just wrote that song for you. Thanks. You're welcome. See you guys. Bye. Bye.